Welcome to San Diego Market Movers. I'm your host, Valley, and we're back with our favorite, Woody Henderson. Welcome back to the show. Well, thanks for having me. Great to be here. Yeah, we love it when you're here. So, Woody, you have a story. Could be a thriller. Could, could be, be a nightmare. <laughs> could be a, a happy ending about interest rates. Can Absolutely. you tell us about it? Absolutely. Well, you know, a lot of people are concerned about interest rates, and uh, some people are, I'm going to wait until interest rates come down. And the good news is that interest rates now are lower than they have been since July. Mm -hmm. So this may be a good time to make a move. I wanted to tell a story about clients of mine that were here in February looking to purchase a home. Interest rates were similar to where they are today. And um, they found a beautiful home, made an offer, got it accepted. They paid $700,000 for a beautiful three-bedroom home mm. at Oceanside. Nice. Awesome. Well, I was just checking the value of their home, did a market analysis for them just this morning. The value of their home has gone up by $60,000 in 10 months. That translates to $6,000 a month. Mm -hmm. The equity that they're earning is greater than the house payment that they're making. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah, and so they weren't fearful. They stepped into the interest rates, did an interest rate buy down. Now they're just gaining wealth, and mm -hmm. it's just so amazing and so gratifying to to see Actual that happen numbers, for them. You know, exactly. Actual example of somebody who had the faith to get in the market, buy a property early, take the interest rate, and now they're accruing equity at a rate faster than their monthly payment. Absolutely. Their house is actually paying them to live in it. Right. Yeah. Instead of having to rent it. Like you're Absolutely. basically, I guess that's girl math when you do it. <laughs> it's, you're living for free. <laughs> and then you have a program called In It to Win It. We do. Tell us about it. We do. So I started in the business in 2005 and then from um, about 2005 to 2008, the market really, really uh, slowed down. It was definitely mm -hmm. a buyer's market. Uh, coming into 2012, 2013, we started to see more competition, more situations where there were multiple offers. So at that time, I developed what I called uh, um, how, how to succeed in a competitive market, a 10-step process for making sure that my clients would prevail if they came into competition. Well, fast forward to 2020, 2019. Mm -hmm. Today, we've seen a lot more intense competition. So I took the success in a competitive market and refined it based on what I see as a listing agent. Mm -hmm. So the purchase agreement itself has 75 points of negotiation Lee. in it. Yeah. And so in order to get an offer accepted in, in, in a competition, yours has to stand out. It has to be stronger. It has mm -hmm. to be cleaner. You have to have a better relationship with the other agent. Mm -hmm. So one of the first things that we do in our In It to Win It program, when our clients find a home they want to buy, we simply give the other agent a call and find out what the seller is looking for. We mm -hmm. also determine, is there competition? Got and it. if there is competition, we write the offer and present it differently than mm -hmm. if there is no competition. Got it. So pre-negotiate, find out what the seller wants, write the contract such that there's nothing in that contract that a seller could obje object to, such that they don't even need to write us a counter offer. And that's how we're getting offers accepted in an intensely competitive environment over yeah. and over again and so that's the outcome that in it to win it plan is for the outcome to win that you, that property your offer wins that property absolutely and it it's not sense. always the highest price that gets yeah. gets accepted it's the best strongest you cleanest have 75 offer. opportunities to present the best offer exactly right? okay <laughs> awesome well i always love to learn from you and i love it when you're on the show so thank you so much for sharing well thanks for having me thanks guys mm -hmm.